Hey guys, Tony here. Last day of Lightbox. Let's go. This video shares some of my highlights from the 2023 Lightbox Expo. I had an enjoyable time at the event and I want to share some of those experiences with you. The majority of info I learned at this conference was about story and storyboarding. Here's a screenshot with the workshops that I got to attend. So Lightbox is really valuable because of the things that you can learn from industry pros of all ages. It's a great place to meet new people. You can find out about job opportunities, get feedback on your work, and I think it's just really fun. It's a place that's packed with a ton of people who love being creative. There's really, there's not that much to dislike. I'm going to share a few images from workshops that I got to view. Whether talking about the visual impact of drawings, the need to design for storytelling, or techniques for telling engaging stories, the common element is that the quality of visual communication is everything when it comes to working on the job as a storyboard artist. You know, and to some extent, every single job that you're working on in the industry has some kind of a connection to storytelling. So even though you're not a story artist, if you're like a concept designer or if you're a viz dev artist, you really need to embed story in all of the visuals that you create. My one complaint about Lightbox, it's that it's just way too crowded. You can see people getting corralled into tight spaces just to get a ticket for a workshop that's not even happening for two hours. Unless you can be in two places at the same time, you're just not going to be able to secure a spot if you want to go to workshops back to back. The reality is you're going to have a lot of downtime in between workshops, but that's why it's kind of cool to go to the demo area or to the exhibition hall. So the exhibition hall was an absolute blast. Recruiters were stationed to give portfolio reviews and feedback. Copic Markers was lending out uh, tools so artists could go and try and cover up this wall. Vendors were showing their new wares and cool technology. And there are hundreds of artists selling illustrations and art and just so much fun stuff. Uh, really, there's something for everyone. And it was just packed the entire time I was there. Uh, save some money and go and support some artists. You're going to have a blast. I took some notes at various workshops and have compiled info in the PDF linked in the description. Feel free to check it out and download a copy. So, while these gatherings are pricey, I think they hold a considerable value to anyone trying to get into the industry. I hope this video has been helpful to you. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.